Let's talk gang, let's eat. This is my first Vlad reaction. So let me know if y'all want to see more Vlad reactions after these. Let's talk gang, let's eat. We are back with another reaction on that gang shit, man. Y'all know we never, ever on no lame shit. We on that double G shit. Y'all know we throw them G's up. Everybody, what you throwing up? What you throwing up? It's the G. 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 Hey, y'all, y'all know that's us. Y'all know that's we. Kevin Gates says that he wants to give NBA young boy a big hug and explain why he doesn't support Black Lives Matter. So I see that the beef was actually squashed. But I'm trying to just see what the whole everything was. Y'all know Kevin Gates is real intellectual, so he probably gonna break this down just as enough as enough as uh, as we need him to. Let's go though. Original link, all that good shit will be down below. Let's go. I just speak about Louisiana. I, I've always wondered this. I, I don't know if I ever asked you this. Yeah, we're a different breed. Do 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 Vlad got on a Pornhub shirt? This nigga Vlad be out of control. He out of control. What happened when you a young boy? I love him to death. He's just on his journey right now. There's nothing he could do to make me stop. First line, I love him to death. He's just on his journey right now. Him. I got his face tattooed on me because I see myself in him. Wow. He's going through a lot of trials and tribulations. Wish I could put my arms around him right now. That shit killed me to see him suffer. I wish I could just put my arms around him right now. I'm gonna always love you forever, but he just on his journey right now. That's what brothers do. Bro, why is Kevin Gates so motherfucking me authentic? Why it seemed like he actually me meant that what he said? Like, you can feel what Kevin Gates says. He's one of them type people. He's a figure that you can feel what the fuck he says. Just because his voice and shit that powerful. These are rappers. They talk on the microphone for a living. Half the people that, that, I, that, I, that I'm interested in, that we interested in, You guys ever talked like recently? Yep. As a, a, a like right after Super General drop. Really? Yeah. What was that conversation like? I mean, it ain't what we discuss is what we discuss. Yeah. But I told him I love. Him. I love. Him. Do you see him possibly as how you probably thought of yourself a few years ago when you were going through it? Where it felt the legal system was a never ending process, just putting you through it, putting you through it. Yeah. But it was testing your faith. Man, and testing hurt me. Man. That hurt me to see him going to court. You could see how weighed down he was. You going, not knowing the outcome. Nobody ever even talks about the pain on the person. That's one thing I can say about Kevin Gates. He real intellectual, but he also like spiritual. Like, he, uh, he just be vibing real hard. You know what I'm saying? Like, he really cared about the pain that he felt like NBA Youngboy was surfing. Like, he not dealing with his own pain and shit. Like, it's hard to put somebody else past you. I can tell he really will put somebody see, else past him. That That's what you got to do to you fuck with somebody. It, just, it was heavy on him. I just want to put my arms around him. Hey, I love you. Stand up in their chest. Yo. How did you deal with that? I had to stand up in their chest. I'm already a nigga. I'm born guilty. <laughs> I'm a nigga. <laughs> I hear your car smell like weed. Let me search. When I change my people, places, and things, and change my perspective, you know, police speak to me like the police, police that done arrested me and all of that. They speak to me now and say they proud of me. That sounds like the rhetoric yeah, you know that what that in this interview that people hated you for. Though. I don't give a fuck what they hate because y'all ain't never committed no crimes. Y'all ain't really did nothing. Y'all don't do nothing but when y'all get... See, they ain't never been in programs. I've been from the juvenile detention system all the way to the to the adult jail. So a lot of the sheriffs and the police and deputies, they was, they, they was prison guards at first. So I know them coming out getting a paycheck before they was road deputies and all of that. So we, I ain't been knowing me since I was a kid. In and out, this bitch revolving door. Ain't nothing to do in Louisiana but go to jail or die. I don't care what people don't like. They got mad when I said, I don't support Black Lives Matter. Because who they matter to? We kill each other all day. We talk about each other all day. You know who talk about me the most on the internet? Niggas. It's, and, and, and that's why he don't support them. I mean, the shit kind of makes sense. We got to do better. We can't just be talking about each other the way that we do sometimes, especially like with the Black Lives Matter movement and all that good shit. 
I know it's frustrating Niggas, for him, you know especially somebody. Niggas. Two of them. <laughs> Make you don't want to be a nigga. Yeah, man, it don't be no, it don't be nobody else talking about me. It be niggas, my own people that look like me, talk about me like a dog, kick me when I'm down. Can't wait. <laughs> look, look, look at Gates. Went to jail, they celebrated, clapped their hands. It was happy. I don't look at color and see race no more. I see real and fake. That's it. Even when I see police, what's up, big man? Don't work too hard. <laughs> did, 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 I'm gonna try not to, Gates. Did, did it affect you that it was it was somebody of your own color that sent you to, to the institution? You know how niggas go to jail? Cause niggas tell on niggas. Tell it's it a on each other. conviction rate amongst blacks. They tell. <laughs> you ain't know that. That's what niggas do. They just talk good as a bitch. For sure, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Hey, just when we talking about the black black race right now, I'm not gonna lie, we are good at talking. We just talk a lot. I ain't gonna lie, we very good at the talking. We got to do better at putting actions, actions That's on shit. Do. That's why we got the best rappers. So you don't feel like it's like you know, it's us versus the white man. Or man, we system. was taught wrong. We was taught wrong. Don't no motherfucking white man to pick my motherfucking destiny. I was in my own way." I was self sabotage. I gotta take accountability for me. That's real. I got to. That's real. Nah, I don't celebrate. I never no. realized what we do. We do kind of point the finger at a whole nother race. Queen and all they've been called about the pumpkin because I know from slavery, you know, my my ancestors were slaves. So I know what the pumpkin stands for when they used to hang us and put the pumpkin on top of our head. Really? I'm not inviting that energy into my life. Yeah, that's what that is. That jack o' lantern. That's a nigga. Huh. Yeah, he put the punk up and gouge his eyes out, everything, put the pumpkin over his head and carved the bitch up. That's what that did, hanging from a tree. You know, I don't celebrate that, but did this white dude right here next to me, did he do that to me? He ain't did that to me. And if he do, I bowed him to the floor. What's that? Oh, I'm a die trying. So I'm just saying, like, we was taught wrong. We be having this, man, man, watch out for the white man. Man, but I, I ain't never had no problem with no white. They been niggas. And I look, That's I like, the card hard like, rally. It's crazy. Like even in jail, I'm like, okay, we can stick it. together and ride in this bitch. They giving the black people cold food. Man, when we stood up in that bitch, come on, let's go for it. Let's but we gonna fight with the police. Come on, let's, when they came in there with them guns, them fucking baby powder guns, them the, you know that box spray and all that. You know what them niggas did me? They all went got in their wreck. You and me, probably two other black dudes and a Mexican. The warden even told me, I respect you. You're a man. Start sticking by yourself. See, we was taught wrong. See, I live in reality. I don't live in you showing me a graphic image of somebody. And, and then saying, I'm oh, running God, with man, it. We got to get tight. We got to just World War III. Because y'all ain't bought all it. Because soon as they come out there with them, them, them pepper spray and them guns. That's deep. I'm, I'm, I'm agreeing with, I'm going to have to agree with Kevin Gates on that. What y'all think, man? Y'all let me know in the comment section. Is he right or he wrong? I think he right. I think you're right. I think that we do need to do a better job of supporting each other before we could just get here out here and trying to have a movement and shit going. On some real shit. On some real shit. Guns, you know how a nigga get to doing? Running. Let me see you die for it since you believe in it so much. The niggas just talk good as a bitch, man. That's why it's real and fake. I don't know what color a real person gonna be. I don't know what color a fake person gonna be. How you, how you know somebody real? They do real things. How you know somebody fake? They do fake shit. They do whole shit. People hate when you, when you say shit like that because they're like... I don't they, care, they, they I don't don't care what people a say. Group thing I don't care like, what people say because I'm really a gangster. What I look like arguing with a rapper or a goofy? I'm not tripping on that. I'm a gangster and, and then, a gentleman. And that's, then that's what his mindset... We're going to end the video there. That's why his mindset is the way he is. He considers himself a human being. I'm sitting here wondering how you even able to say these shit. So like, I'm like Kevin Gates, you got us. It's not looking. You're not looking reliable right now, for sure. You're not looking reliable, Lento Gang. I'm seeing that he literally just, he just care what he got to say, what he think, because these are some bold statements that he was making. I wasn't expect for him to say, but I agree with damn everything he said. That he's saying, I said we saying. I mean, we both are black, but. We just got to do better as a movement type shit.
just got to do better, just sticking together and just, just coming together as a whole and not on some separate, like, this my type, this my version of Black Lives. Nah, this my version. That's a lot, a lot of shit that I'll be seeing. Look, like, comment, subscribe, though. We're going to end the reaction there. Make sure you tune in if you want more. I'm glad him and uh, NBA Youngboy Swatch their beef. Hopefully Kodak and Youngboy Swatch their beef now. Like, comment, subscribe again. Though. I'm going to see you on this right.